Here we are at the theater of Butrint, two and a half thousand years, a beautiful monument excavated in the 20s and 30s. It stood all that period. Uh, one of the great um, concerns that we have today is about the number of visitors. Butrint, when we started the project uh, 18 years ago, uh, used to have like two, two and a half thousand visitors a year. Now there are over 300,000 visitors a year. So the visitors, I think, are becoming uh, a problem because the site is becoming too successful. This is a great uh, challenge. This is a great uh, example where what do you do when sites become successful? When we started the program here about you know uh, excavation, attraction of the site, protection, the landscape protection, the in, in, uh, inscribed on the World Heritage Site, etc., etc., uh, we always thought that the Butrint was going to uh, become a successful model. However, here we are on the crossroad where uh, the large numbers of people that are coming here are threatening the very experience of the visit, uh, the, 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 why the visits um, are so important. So they are, they are threatening the, that wonderful feeling of you exploring a ancient site full of uh, vegetation, full of uh, birds, you know, uh, surrounded by water, so that particular spirit of Butrin is threatened by a large number of people. So here we are in the crossroad, what should we do? And that is, I think, the challenge that Albania will face now with this site, which has become uh, internationally famous.